Over the past 170 years, Virginia has experienced true hurricane force conditions 13 times, but a hurricane hasn't made a direct landfall on our shores. So how have we gone so long without a direct hit? Craig Moeller explains in today's Hurricane Fast Fact. When a hurricane moves ashore, the intersection of the storm center with the coastline is the landfall. If you check out the landfalls from 1851 to present, you'll quickly see that Virginia, Maryland and Delaware have yet to suffer one. New Jersey has been hit only once. North Carolina has had many landfalls and New York has been hit several times too. So why the break for the Mid-Atlantic? Geographically, the Mid-Atlantic region is concave. In order for a hurricane to make landfall here, it needs to move northwest or westward. Now the winds aloft that steer hurricanes typically blow from the west or the southwest across our region. But if those winds are weak or higher pressure is to our north or northeast, look out. That was the case back in 2003 when Hurricane Isabel came in over Ocracoke, North Carolina. We took a heavy hit, but the storm could have easily moved farther north along the Outer Banks, or worse yet, come in over Virginia Beach or at the mouth of the Chesapeake Bay. Had that occurred, our region might be vastly different from what we are today. And it's important to remember a hurricane doesn't have to make landfall to destroy coastal communities. Storms passing close to our coast or moving up from the south across North Carolina can do a lot of damage. We've seen that. And just because we haven't had a direct hit recently doesn't mean it can't happen.